In today's global marketplace, we are living in an era of unprecedented change and uncertainty. When it comes to connection, we have witnessed immense disruption from the norm, but also a huge opportunity for innovation. Now more than ever, our most powerful asset is how we connect with one another. We are at the forefront of a new way of leading and must reimagine collaboration to innovate faster and further together. How do we spread accountability and prepare our organization for the future? This is not about connecting more. We don't need that. This is about connecting intelligently. If we want to tap into collective brilliance, we need to understand how to take away inefficiency and bring insights together in the right ways. We have an opportunity to evolve in this moment in time by applying a method that can serve us through any culture, any distance, any organization. Let me tell you about a new model of collaborative innovation. Value visibly, communicate carefully, collaborate confidently, and trust totally. How might you create your own sparring zones in your teams? Because difference is all about dissonance and conflict, and we need to design ways where we're actually solving challenges and enabling different views to come in to get big things done. The pressure to communicate quickly can lead many of us into taking shortcuts or sometimes leaving out context altogether. Let me share with you a true story between two colleagues, Sarah and John. One Wednesday afternoon, Sarah has an idea for a project. So she shoots off an email saying, quick thought, what do you think of this idea for the deliverable? What she really meant was I have a great idea. It's not fully fleshed out yet, but I'd love to get your thoughts. At about 8 p.m. that night, after a long day of video meetings, John reads the message and is a bit confused. He thought the deliverable was done. So he sends a message saying, how would this fit in? It doesn't seem like you thought this through, dot, dot, dot. What he really meant was, Sarah, you're closer to the work than I am. I need more context from you. What could have been a 15 minute exchange took five hours of time, stress, and fear over that 12 hour period. How many of us have been in a situation like this before? The truth of the matter is that reading messages carefully is the new listening, and writing clearly is the new empathy. What was implicit in traditional body language now has to be explicit in our digital body language. Ericus enabled us to be more innovative about the way we connect and interact digitally. She has brought to us a new way of thinking and a new way of collaborating and helped us really accelerate our innovation. This tool is not just about connecting as individuals. I believe it is the key to changing cultures in our organization. When's the last time you felt fully creative, engaged, and brave as an adult? I believe that if leaders and teams can break away from unneeded bureaucracies, cross team dysfunctions and delays, and events and activities that are just busy work versus true innovation, we can unleash exponential growth and innovate through teamwork in ways we've never imagined. <laughs>